Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to fix some of these random apps that haven't colored their recent apps entries with the new Lollipop API. Now with Android 5.0, Google made a new API that allows developers to color the header on their recent apps entries. But not all developers are quick to adopt new features like this, so you end up with a mix of some colored headers and some grayish white headers. Well, developer Mohammed AG decided he'd fix this issue with a new Expose module. To get this one going, you'll need to be rooted with the Expose framework installed. But if you need any help with that stuff, just check out my full tutorial at the link in the description below. Then to get started, head to the download section of your exposed installer app and search Tenant Recents Panels, then tap the top result. From here, swipe over to the Versions tab, then hit the Download button next to the most recent entry. After a second or two, Android's installer interface will come up, so tap Install here. When that's finished, you'll get a notification from Exposed telling you that the module hasn't been activated yet and that a reboot is needed. So tap this notification, then on the following screen, tick the box next to the newly installed module. After that, use the drop menu at the top of the screen to head to the framework section. Then just tap the soft reboot button and press OK on the pop-up. When you get back up, your recent apps should now all have colored headers. The module tries to detect apps that are missing this feature, then uses their predominant color to theme their recent apps entry. But if you're seeing an app that isn't colored automatically, you can set it up manually to an extent. Just head to your app drawer, and then you should find the Tenant Recent Panels app right in here. Now if you see these check marks next to an app's entry, that means the app colors its recent header already. But if you scroll through and find something like Data Size Explorer here that has a color superimposed, that means the module took care of the coloring for you. Then if you have an app that did not get colored automatically, just tap it and it'll be colored from now on. Or, if you don't like the coloring that this module applied to an app, just long press it, and the coloring will be removed. In the future, the developer plans to add a way to set up custom colors for apps, so be on the lookout for that. But in the end, all your recent apps entries should now have colored headers. For the full breakdown, though, be sure to check out my article at the link in the description below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking!